Let me show you how to set up a professional MailChimp squeeze page in five easy steps. The first thing that you want to do is go to bestsqueezepages.com and sign up on that website. What is that? It's an online squeeze page software and hosting service that has over 70 different professional squeeze page designs waiting for you. And the beautiful thing about it is you can set up as many squeeze pages as you need. Use your MailChimp autoresponder service and you can do it in just a few clicks. It's really easy to do. In addition to the squeeze pages, you can also set up full websites, blogs, and sales pages too. So there's a lot of features there under one account. So step one, sign up at bestsqueezepages.com. After you sign up, the next step, I mentioned it's, it's an online solution, so you don't have to download anything. All you do is log into the website. After that, you just pick a template. And as I mentioned, they have over 70 designs. And I'll go inside the website and show you exactly how to do that. But all you do is pick one, click a button, and that squeeze page is live on the domain. Now, if you're using MailChimp, there's one other thing you have to do. You have to go to your MailChimp account and just copy a code and paste it in a field. That's the fifth step and it's very easy to do. What I'm gonna do next is show you some of the squeeze page templates that are available and then log in and set up a MailChimp squeeze page in just a few seconds. And here's some examples. As I mentioned, there's over 70 different designs that you can use with your MailChimp service. And these are great squeeze pages here. They can drop in any background. They've got text only squeeze pages, video squeeze pages, and just a bunch of different designs for any type of business. You'll find something that you could use at best squeeze pages. They also have responsive squeeze pages as well as mobile squeeze pages. So if you need a mobile squeeze page for any reason, you can get it right here. But let's do this. Let me log in to a squeeze, Best Squeeze Pages account and show you how to set up a MailChimp squeeze page. Okay, so after step one, which is sign up at Best Squeeze Pages, step two is log in to Best Squeeze Pages, and here you are. This is the login page, and there's a, dump, a bunch of different features. As I mentioned earlier, there is a cPanel, which gives you full hosting. There's also Slideshow Maker, Online Form Builder, and a bunch of other features, too. You can see more about it right below this video. But how do you set up a squeeze page? Well, all you do is, as I mentioned, you could add as many domains as you want. And you can see there's a bunch of different ones here. And I added one, called, actually I'm using a subdomain called MailChimp.SqueezePageExample.com. So you just add the domain that you want the squeeze page on to your account. And then you click on it and you go to this page here. And all you do is click that right here and pick a template and put it on the page and it's live in seconds. But I just want to talk about some of the other features here that you have available. There are, these are SEO friendly squeeze pages. You can use Google Analytics right there as well and drop it in. It's very easy to do. Um, email accounts with your hosting and much more. Again, check out all the features below. But let's set up that squeeze page. So step three is click on your templates and choose one and there are a bunch of different ones to choose from again video and text only mobile designs too I'm just gonna scroll to the bottom and choose one down here and let me just mention one thing you can also preview them too so if you want to see a preview of the home or thank you page you just click on that right there and it's easy to do so I'm just gonna pick this one with this background right here so you just check on it there's different backgrounds where you can upload your own and then I'm going to click apply and that's it now let's go to the live domain and I'll show you exactly how easy that is now here's the domain right here okay and this is how it looked like before I added the template so now I'm just gonna refresh it this is MailChimp.SqueezePageExample.com and here you go and look at that now you've got a beautiful squeeze page in place right there now the one thing that we want to do is because it's a MailChimp we're using MailChimp we want to add MailChimp to our opt-in form so let me show you how to do that so we just went through the four steps the fifth step for the MailChimp squeeze page is to add your MailChimp code to your template 
and I just logged into a, my MailChimp account, and you just copy and paste this right here. So you just copy this right here. So I'm copying that. And now we go back to Best Squeeze Pages. I'm back to Best Squeeze Pages for my domain there. And all you do is click Autoresponder. And you've got an Autoresponder type window right here. So you just drop down, go to MailChimp. And then all you do is paste the code in right there. Click Update and you're set. You've updated the autoresponder and your squeeze page right now, this MailChimp.squeeze page example right now, everybody that opts into this is added to your MailChimp account. So it's that easy to set up a MailChimp squeeze page in five easy steps. Again, step one, sign up at bestsqueezepages.com. Step two, log into the site. Step three, pick the template. Step four, just click that apply button and the squeeze page is live. And then finally, step five, just paste your MailChimp code in that field that I just showed you. And that's it. Your squeeze page is live with your MailChimp autoresponder in place. Now, your next question may be, well, how do I edit this? Maybe I want to change that image or add some text here. Well, that's very easy, too. Let me show you that. All we do is log in. Again, go back to Best Squeeze Pages and click the Editor button. Here we are back at Best Squeeze Pages. And to edit, all you do is go down here. There's two pages with each squeeze page template that they have for you. The home page where everybody lands with the opt-in form and then a thank you page. That thank you, It's set up where if a, a website visitor goes to your squeeze page and they enter their information, they're directed to the thank you page. So you set up something there, or let's say you're selling an ebook and you want to set up 10 different squeeze pages for this ebook, and you only want to set up maybe one sales page, right, for your ebook. So you can direct all the traffic there by just changing this to your ebook sales page and whatever URL that is, or it can be your core website, anything, wherever you want the traffic to go after they opt in, you can change it right here and just update that. So it makes it easier to set up a bunch of different squeeze pages for one product or service. But let's say you want to edit the home page. So you just click this here and you'll see the editing functions right here. Now, there's a bunch of different things you can do, but if you want to just change text, all you do is type and save that's it type and save and then you go over here and you click save right there and you'll see instantly the changes on the live site and that's the cool thing about it you're it's easy to get the squeeze page live with your mailchimp autoresponder in place and then when you edit you can check how it looks on an actual live squeeze page it makes it a lot easier for you to do but let's say you want to add images or video and things like that you can do that with these buttons up here image right here you can use the graphics gallery by just clicking browse server if you need buttons and things like that buy now buttons or arrows and cool things like that they've got them there or just click upload and you can add any images that you have on your computer if you want to change out this picture you just double click on it you can see and you can just upload it right there and then when you're done, all you do is click Save. Now all I did was change the text on that, right? So let's go here. I'm back on the live site, so I'll just update it. And you can see the text, type and save. It was changed right there. And it's that easy to do. So this is the best and easiest way for you to set up an effective squeeze page for your business. Right below this video, we've got a great guide on, that'll take you through it step by step on how to set up a MailChimp squeeze page. So get the free guide right below this video. Thank you.